that didn't come up in the uh, CNN interview is, is her now apparent support for, at least in some aspects, the border wall. I mean, we've seen in her, in her ad on the border, she uses images of the border wall. Uh, she says she'll sign uh, the, the, the Senate bill, which provided $650 million for uh, more border wall construction. Uh, she had called previously the border wall a medieval vanity project and a stupid use of money that she vowed to block. So what's changed there? Look, this is another issue that, as it gets into the public discourse, is, is very misleading. Democrats in general, Kamala Harris, Joe Biden, uh, you know, Barack Obama, have always been supportive of building barriers and walls for certain parts of the border as part of a comprehensive border security strategy. Well, right? but, but, but wait a minute. She, she, she called the... And monitoring. I mean, she called the border wall a medieval yeah. vanity project, a stupid use of money, and said that she would block funding for it. So she, she wasn't talking about supporting, well, you that, know... Uh, on the subject of transnational gangs, let's be perfectly clear. The president's medieval vanity project is not going to stop them. This issue mm -hmm. is about a vanity project for this president. Right. Mm -hmm. And it is a problem of his own making. Right. And listen, when I travel this country, Folks have plenty enough problems that they need their president to focus on you know instead of a wall that, by the way, because I was a prosecutor for many years, including the Attorney General of California, I specialize on transnational criminal organizations. Yeah. That's, that wall ain't going to stop them. No. No. <laughs> That's true. The, the border wall that Donald Trump has proposed is a huge boondoggle and waste of taxpayer money. He effectively talked about a wall across the entire border rather than using barriers of different kinds effectively in a cost-effective manner, including imagery from satellites, including on-the-ground intel to secure and lock down the border. Uh, what Kamala Harris is for is securing it in the most cost-effective way possible to stop the illegal flow of people, of guns, of drugs across that southern border. And of course, Donald Trump's border wall would not work, would waste taxpayer money, and of course, Barriers and walls are a part of the overall comprehensive strategy that Kamala Harris will deliver on to secure the southern border. Democrats in general, Kamala Harris, Joe Biden, uh, you know, Barack Obama, have always been supportive of building barriers and walls. That's 100% a lie. If you do five minutes of research, you'll get the truth and see how completely different the truth is. 